Good morning to you, Art. It's looking like all signs are pointing towards this having been an arson fire. Now, we do know this apartment complex right off of Tuscaloosa Avenue. We have 10 units here. It's a two story building, and that person uh, that was taken into police custody, we know before then he was taken to UAB Hospital just to get checked out. Now, take a look at the video that we, our photographer Kerry, was able to shoot a little bit earlier of what the scene looked like. Uh, we know that all, of all people that live in this complex have now been displaced. Red Cross was here just a few moments ago assisting some of those families. It seems as though about five apartments of people at that time still did not have a place to go. But thankfully now we can report that everyone's okay. They're able to um, find a place to stay for the rest of um, the night and into tomorrow as well. Now we do know that one man I actually spoke with that lives here says that he's been here for seven years. Um, and obviously this was not something that he wanted to wake up to. If we can come back out live now, you can see, I'm sure we're zoomed in on the top of this apartment complex. That is where the fire started and one of those units quickly spread to all of the other units units as well. This investigation still ongoing. As a matter of fact, our one question I had were, were there any um, smoke detectors in here? That's something that we don't have an answer to at this time. We're going to work to figure out for you as this investigation continues to unfold. Coming to you live from Birmingham this morning, Alex Finney, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.